Orja pappa pa jamma. Ja pappa jamma ha. Pappa jamma. Ja pappa jamma ha. Yami yami yami. I've got God in my tummy. Uh. Hey, I just wanted to give an uh, a testimonial or another, I guess what you would call example. That's the word, example of not just where truth is caught, not taught where they agree with each other, but where the experience actually like reveals that what I saw or thought was truth was not truth, if that makes any kind of sense. Anyhow, when I grew up, I remember when I was growing up, I thought that, you know, heaven was like in the sweet by and by someday, go home to glory, peace, bliss, in the future, enjoy God when you die. But, uh, in 1994, what I thought was truth was overrode. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. You know, anyhow, this is part two of my series, or maybe it's just two parts, I don't know. I just go with the flow. I go with the flow. But anywho, heaven's accessible, people. And a lot of you know it, I'm speaking to the choir, but anyhow, that's another example in my life, anyhow, where truth is revealed uh, firsthand by God himself and it overrides doctrinal or cognitive mechanical truth uh, I mean that I thought was truth anyhow but uh, you know how it goes anyhow it's like relationship relationship I mean we wouldn't even have the Bible if it wasn't for men encountering God that's all it is really documentation of man interacting with God I mean it seems like that that's pretty important then huh wouldn't you say people anyhow I'll talk to you later bye